Hello everybody, Jet here, and welcome back to my uh, Total War Warhammer 2 playthrough, modded playthrough as uh, Karak Zorn of the Lost Dwarves. Sorry, I lost what I was saying a bit there, as you probably guessed. Um, but, and we are about to siege out the Temple of Skulls. I don't think we can quite go yet. We are building there. Um, taking my time, kind of, here. I don't want to rush. Ready I want to get troops. myself into a really good position to attack them first. We've got plenty of troops here to back begin. me up. Can I merge them? I can. Okay, let's Setting check off. which one is which. Lord yeah, hold fast. Yeah. I'll get on it. We've got two hold fasts. There we go. So basically merging all those guys where they'll get a bit more replenishment and we'll do a bit of unit swapping around here just to uh, build them up while sieging their out. It may even be worth sending a small force down to there. Uh, I'm not going to bother with that. Growth, 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 growth. And yeah. Oh, Grimgore is doing quite well up there. Kara Castle is suffering. But it gives us something to go and uh, rescue afterwards. All the dwarfs there. Uh, we are at an end turn. While we go through the end turn, a little oh, bit of a. Uh, if you must. I make no promises as to the. Uh, no. A little bit of admin. Bloody cold in my room, and there's a lot of wind outside because we've got a massive storm here in the UK. So, uh, if you hear me shivering or you hear the wind, um, yeah, that's that's why. <laughs> um, I've uh, got a massive thick jumper on while I'm recording here. If you don't know, I've got a study. I've got a little studio, but it's in an outbuilding rather than in the house because it's the only building we had in our current house. So, only room even. There we go. Attack! Time for a reckoning. My anger burns bright. I'm going. Onward. Let's pull out the lowest. On my way. Cast the runes. Well, I may as well pull a few more out because we'll reinforce anyway. As somebody has pointed out, I accidentally out named them the Bood Miners. Um, that should be the uh, Blood Miners. Hmm. There we go, that is correct now. And let's get on with our replenishment. How much replenishment? We get replenishment from that. We get more replenishment from that. No, we don't get replenishment from raiding. Okay. And we're not getting any um, income there anyway. They are probably building up there, so I do want to be a little careful. Hmm. Watch your orders. Oh, and you want to be joining this army. There we go. It's getting a nice Fane in there as well to assist. Um, oh yeah, my Rune Lord got picked off. Uh, we'll see how all this goes. So yeah, we're getting there, guys. It's a matter of taking my time here. I don't want to rush, because if I rush, I will kill myself. As I said, I suspect they're probably building over there. Ready. Of the way beards and belts. To be fair, let's take pretty much everything out. We march. Summon me if you do. Lots of lovely replenishment. That's also heading out. Wrong way. It does feel a little cheese, but they still have to fight everything. Unless they have 
Unless he has lightning strike, which I don't believe he does. Yes. Moving. Okay, they're not building up. I wanted to go and check if they were building over there, so that'll do nicely. Let us untax here. It's fine. Everything is fine. Bit more income there. And some spice. Again, I do apologise, guys, but I really am taking my time here. I don't want to go into this early. I want to make sure I am 100% ready to batter them into non-existence. The danger is that they could well. Oh, that is beautiful. If the Spirit of a Jungle takes there, that's actually quite nice. I'd like the Spirit of a Jungle to go and start battering Grimgore, but that's unlikely. Ooh, Clan Angra under there. Can't see them, but they're definitely there. Nice. Yeah, got other really good things. Immortal, please. Master of Runecraft. Hmm. To battle. We're getting there, slowly but steadily. Bring the fight! Onward! Vengeful ruler! Lord of Clan One more Hawk. turn and then I'm gonna get myself ready to go. We'll stop messing around and we will actually go. I'm almost tempted. I see, I, I should have just built. Ugh. I should have just built a, um. A battering ram and gone through the gate so I could arch the enemy down. But we can still arch the enemy a lot because fighting on the walls is never quite as fun. The dwarves are really good at kind of building that breach, you know, getting that kind of wedge in through a dent in the walls. Oh, there we go. Oh, somebody did comment on this, interlocking locking shields. Uh, plus five, five armor for dwarf shield units. Now, I believe that just means any unit with a shield, which most of these longbeards are. Unless I'm using great weapon ones, then obviously they're not. Uh, but in the majority of cases, that's actually most of my units, so. Aye, aye. Grudges will be settled. One, two, three, four. Six. Let us be about this. It's as good as done. On my way. Okay. Let's make sure we get the blood miners in, even though they're a bit weaker. I'm going. You can be moved into the main army as well. I will not shame my clan. No way. Wrong one. Let us begin. Okay. Oh, the clan demands war. I'm very tempted to do a bit of merging. No. Wish me luck, guys. This is going to be a fun battle. We've got a reasonable amount of towers. We've got a reasonable amount of reinforcements. We've got a hell of a lot of ranged here. Uh, so ideally, we're going to try and let my range do the majority of the work. Obviously, Frond is being held back because he is nearly dead from just attrition in general. Um, we'll hit the main gate first. For the ancestors! The clans unite! For Grimnir! Dull! Dwarf warriors! Longbeards! That's what we want! Find 
your targets. Who do you want me to kill first? That. The ancient Stegodon and those Croxies are probably the most scary things there. Let's start pinging the Temple Guard, actually. Group all of my range together to put them on there. Getting everybody moving forwards. These guys are going to provide a nice wedge onto the wall, which will be good. Obviously, once they start getting closer, I'm going to rush these guys in right behind. I'm going to put them mostly on this flank, because that seems to be where most of the enemies are. These guys are going to throw themselves into the same place. Just going to keep this pressure on. See, we're damaging. These guys are also facing away from us. Which makes them a little easy to do damage on until they start moving. Let's hit those skinkies. You know, I'd like to move forwards and take out those croxies if I can. Because croxies will be a nightmare once we're on the ground. Making their little wedges. Obviously, they are fighting the best of the best of the lizard men, which is going to make things interesting, but we're, I'm sure we can manage. You guys can all start pushing straight over as well. These guys will make short work of the skinks. This is going to be the trickiest bit, but as long as we can keep the fire in. Let's try and take that guy down, because he is also does do range damage. Let's do damage to his temple guard. Things are going nicely up here, there is my lords. We are battering the lizards, we are making good wedges onto the walls here. And my guys over here are slowly pushing forwards, we're doing damage to that. Just marching my dwarves through those skinks, because they're only skinks, that's perfect. And that's also poisoning my people, so that's a really good one to get rid of. More people up, please. Oh, that is beautiful. Let's hit him. Oh. I can hit him. I might not be able to easily. Let's try and hit them. We have a proper full control of the wall here now. Bring everything. These guys are just pushing through. But they've got so few units left on those walls. We've just battered through them nicely. This is quite a clean cut battle actually. We just 
flooded the walls with dwarven bodies and, you know, so pushed the lizard men back. Shredding these guys from ranged. That is such cool colouring. He is going to be fun to fight, but he's most, you know, he is anti infantry lord, so. Let us send all of my lords at him at once, assuming they can get down. On the edge. Stay as one. Runes of smiting upon them. It'll get done. Fine. He could technically come up onto the walls. Oh no, he's monstrous infantry. I'm going to try and get them all there. There you go. You get them down, please. Too early. Oh! Oh, and the Croxies have come down. Okay. It's time to reinforce. Especially as they just battered my lords. You can get off, please. Yeah, that was maybe a little too ambitious, but now everybody's coming in. For the ancestor gods, kill the off splitters. You guys can just get up onto the walls. War of vengeance. Everybody else can murder those Croxies. So few of them, these world guys will do a lot of damage to us though. Oh. oh wow. But we are overwhelming them. This is the perfect situation for them. Broken them, let's kill the Lord. Oh. And he breaks. However, 22 kills, including a Lord. Oh, he didn't do that well, but God. It's still a good victory, even if I did manage to murder a lord, lord while doing it. This is over now. It's going to be a quick charge to that last settlement, and the last defenders have fallen. I'm resisting making a pun about the last defenders, last defenders in their last city. I'll be good. So, yeah, that was a nice, solid victory for us, uh... You know, we wiped out all of them. We didn't lose too many. And we did have substantially more troops, to be fair, so. Summon me no. Disciplined is always good. Time for the reckoning. For the wisdom of Valaya. Summon me if you dare. No, See, uh, that really see. should be on the coast and the port, but... That can be demolished. Oh, nice. I'll come back to that. My axe 
I would quite like that actually. So we can push down there to get that. Hmm. Oh, let's get that. Reduce the cooldown on the abilities. Let us begin. Yeah, let's loot. Let's level there up. Get the extra oath gold, it's always useful. And somebody has been shouting at me for not doing that. <laughs> I don't just do things because you shout at me for doing things, but it does help me remember to do them. I'm very happy with that. Our kingdom is growing nicely. And this gives us such a better defensive position. Um, we've still got frets up here, but basically I want to be the, I want to be the Lord east of the mountains basically everything east of the mountains i want to belong to me you know including some of the mountains themselves because that makes sense but uh you know i'm, I'm mostly going east so our next thing's going to be lamia potentially consolidate some territory up here work out what we need to do against the green skins and uh, we're also going to take get for desolation move up to the desolation of nagash which is probably crawling with rats oh my god that is getting nasty My throne stands ready. Do not disappoint me. Oh, Come on, you're getting your butts kicked. Confederating with me is a sensible idea. I see a crocky. Are oh, you? Attack to battle. Time for a reckoning. Beards in belts. Hard them. Goodbye. And the lizard men, the last defenders, My axe for war. are done. Oof. That has been a fun old war. Um, not one I would necessarily want to repeat in a hurry. Take the underway interception. You can just make yourself a bit more deadly. Hmm. Yes, cleanse corruption. Level up again. And public order, please. Though this place should sort itself up relatively quickly now. We'll merge them together, then move up and re-jig ourselves. Though, we're gonna get some a couple of units of slay, some units of slayers in here as well. I will keep the blood miners. I may move for blood miners to the other army, but I'm definitely getting some slayers in there. I don't know what the spirit of jungle are doing, but they don't mind me, so I'm not particularly worried about them wandering around my territory, even if they don't have position. Nope. They must know they're next now. Wait. Why is that not showing us mine? I was there. That was worrying me for a second. Lads, we move. Move. It is time to war. You can actually take this army because you are the more veteran lord. And you can start moving north. I want one of, I want some of each. These guys are not as, these guys aren't as good at dealing with ranged. Um, 
that do have armor piercing damage which could be nice I, I like having a mix they're still all very glass cannony one two three four five six so yeah that, that'll do you are being dispatched You know what? One, two, three. We'll get three of them and two of them. Let us begin. And up the recruitment capacity for briefly. Rolling a few slayers in. There's my flank to replace my current flankers. Um, never a fan of slayers, I'll be honest. I'll try them, but they're just too glass cannony for my likes um i like a good solid line which can just do itself even if it's slower to maneuver um by the time you get to iron breakers i just don't think you ever need anything else because iron breakers are the most ridiculous thing in existence unseasonable weather it's not terrible it's just a bit annoying Damage. My axe thirsts for war. One rag. Let's see. To be there, a little bit of downtime. Oh, this is brilliant because both are exactly the same. Honor is all. Ready. There we go. And you can start double timing up this way as well, but we do need to replenish at some point. To replenish up there. Get the extra growth out. Straight into that. Down here, I'm relatively safe, so I'm probably going to save up for trade buildings as well. Okay. I really don't need that there, but I'm going to keep it there for a moment. Have a look at weapons I can get in a bit. How am I doing diplomatically? Orders? Speak briefly, then remove your vile taint from the hallowed halls of Athens. It's through a gift comply. just to keep them on side for the time being. I don't particularly want to be dealing with those elves at all, so. No, we're gonna position ourselves to hit, hit Lamia. Um, I wanna ideally make sure I do it while they're away or they've just been battered by somebody else. And then from there. We've kind of got our initial expansion sorted. We'll build up the defensive lines around here. Um, and yeah, then we'll probably push north into here. Find out who is there, because there's definitely going to be somebody. But we'll see. Of that. Yes, you start working for all of them. My anger burns bright. So he could probably be got rid of for now, actually. Yeah, it's minus two, but it's not going to be a problem because by the time that's dealt with, my armies will be there. Anyway, guys, that is all going to be stuff for next time. 
As always, thank you very much for watching. I do hope you are enjoying this. Please do feel free to pop any comments in the comment section or jump over to my Discord and say hi. There's a link to my Discord in the comments in the description as well as links to my Twitter, my Patreon and my affiliations with Overclockers and Humble Bundle Games. So please check them out. As always, thank you for watching.